Hey, what's up, everyone? It's your boy, Melly Mel, Romy Rome, the comic book player from the Himalaya. Anyway, I've got another video here to keep you to keep you motivated and hopefully to inspire someone out there to collect comic books. <clears throat> but, you know, that's my job is to help you out and can continue to uh, inspire you or continue to uh, motivate you to collect comic books. Uh, and also, my job is to become a philanthropist, a comic book philanthropist. That's why I like to do all these giveaways. But anyway, um, let me, I got another video here. It's my, I think this is the second time, my second, well, not a thing, right? No, this is my second time doing a first appearance Friday. So I've got, I, like I said, I, I, I'll randomly pick <clears throat> about seven books from my collection, um, five raw books and two CGCs. Um, again, I don't have a lot of books in my collection, so um, this may be, that's why I only keep it as, I'll keep it down to like five books or whatnot, uh, or seven books. <clears throat> and um, CGCs, I still have a lot of books that I need to get graded, and I'm still trying to build my collection by buying someone's collection, but I haven't had a chance to do that yet. Um, no one's selling their collection, well, at least in this part of town, Las Vegas. But uh, but anyway, let's let's move on. Let's let's get let's get let's get to it and uh, let me show you what what I came up with. All right. All right, first one, um, Uncanny number 148. Good book, huh? It's a nice book to have. Uh, I wrote it down, what, I, what, what I'm gonna say about these about these books. Oh, oh, check it out. It's a, a new stat as well. Uh, anyway, this is a first, first appearance of Caliban. Uh, and the, the, the artist is Dave Cockrum and Chris Claremont was the writer. And also this book was published in 1981. So you can buy this book for about maybe five, ten dollars maybe at a high grade. Next book is X-Men 213. This is first first cameo appearance of Mr. Sinister. <clears throat> anyway, um, uh, this book you can probably purchase for about $20 at a high grade. Uh, try to get it at a high grade. Don't settle for anything less than that. Um, if, if you're gonna, that's if you're gonna. I'm thinking um, getting it graded, that's why. But if you just wanna have it in your collection, fine. Maybe a low grade would be fine, like a mid grade or or an eight or a seven. But um, good book to have to, good book to have to. Hi, <laughs> I'm all tongue twisted. Good book to have in your collection, all right? So anyway, uh, what else can I say about this book? Uh, Alan Davis is, is, is the artist and Chris Claremont is the writer. And this book was published in 1987. All right, next book is, another, again, like I said, I just pick these books randomly, uh, randomly pick these books from, from my collection. So I, I'm, there'll be others that I'll show you. I'm sure you, I'm sure you guys are expecting other books that I should show. But also if I don't have them in my collections, in my collection then I, I can't show you those those real key issue books but i'll try to uh come up with something but in the meantime i'll show you what i have in my collection all right so the next book is number 300 uh, this is first first appearance of amelia Vaught and also the introduction of the legacy virus number 300. um the artist is john romita jr Nice, huh? John Romita Sr. is good too. Um, this book was published in 1993 and you can probably find this book in a $3 bin or a $5 bin. Next book we have is Spectacular Spider-Man, number 139. How cool is that, huh? It's a white cover. Anyway, um, this book is a first appearance of Tombstone and the, the artist of this cover was Sal Bushima. I hope I pronounced his name correctly. Sal Basima. Uh, Three dollar bin, maybe, or a dollar bin, but you never know with these uh, first appearances, especially in the MCU, you, you never know who they're gonna uh, <clears throat> introduce or whatnot. But anyway, this book was pu uh, published in 1988. Three to five bucks. 
All right, next book we have is uh, Spider-Man number one. No, I'm sorry, Spider-Man 2099 number one. Uh, I think this book's starting to heat up just because of the uh, the, the, the movie, uh, what was Spider-Verse, I believe. Anyway, um, this is Spider-Man 2099. Uh, first appearance of, duh, of course, uh, Spider-Man 2099. Uh, Rick Leonard was the artist. Uh, that's pretty cool. Anyway, this book was published in 1992. Uh, you can probably buy this book for twenty dollars at a high grade. I would only, again, with this book, try to get it at a high grade if you can. All right. All right. And the two CGC books that I came up with, I just picked them out. I should have picked something more fun to show, but oh well. In the meantime, I'll just show you this: Daredevil number twenty-five. Bam. I think you've seen this already. Uh, anyway, sorry about the glare. Um, 25, this is the first appearance of Mike Murdoch and the Leaf and, and Leaf Frog. Cool, huh? I got a 6.0 on, on this book. Sorry about the glare. And last but not least is Justice League number 10. I got me a 4.5. Uh, this is the first appearance of, oh shoot, Ebony's, uh, <laughs> you know what, I can't pronounce the name. Abnezigar, Abnegazar, Felix, Fa Felix Foss, Wrath, Gas, and first appearance of Lord of Time. Sorry about that, but nice book, huh? I got a 4.5. Uh, this is a, well, it's, it's a pretty, it's a good key issue book. Uh, I don't know. What do you think? I like it. I like I like the, uh, the artwork on this. I wonder who did it. Uh, Murphy Anderson? That's the cover. Anyway, hopefully you like it. And that's it. Um, should I do a giveaway? Uh, well, I, don't, I didn't even think of anything. Um, Oh, I've got some Dazzlers behind me. Uh, maybe I should give one of those away, huh? Not the, not the graded one though. I've got like I've got a ton of, a ton of Dazzlers. Uh, I should get I should have got them all graded, but that's the highest grade that I have, a nine point six. Uh, but I probably got about maybe four more books, uh, four more of these the uh, raw copy, of course, and I should get them graded. But maybe I'll give one away, a raw copy. All right. So let me know if you're interested, or let me know. Give me some suggestions for this video, uh, what I should give away. Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> That's a bad idea. Uh, anyway, uh, why not? I'll, I'll do a mystery box. I can't think of anything, but if you, want, if you want a Dazzler, let me know. I'll give you a raw copy or I'll just, the winner of this video, the giveaway for this video, I'll, I'll do a mis mystery box, all right? It'll contain about three books, maybe three to five books. All right, so, and that's pretty much it. So uh, stay motivated, inspire someone today, and happy hunting. And be kind. Please be kind out there and smile more often and laugh more often. And please uh, subscribe if you can. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. And, man, I just, it's, I know it's, it's a milestone, but I'm just trying to get there. Uh, please uh, share my video if you can or, or uh, recommend it to someone you know. And, uh, and help me grow. All right. So that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.